third time's the freaking charm. <laughs> I relaxed my hair after a year and look at the results, you guys. Great, the relaxer. We finally got the results that we wanted. I'm so happy, y'all. This will be like a voiceover version. I'm just gonna be walking you guys through me relaxing my hair. I did treat this as like a version relaxer, which I probably shouldn't have, but that's okay. If you watch my other relaxer videos, then you know that my hair didn't take all the way. And girl, I want my hair like bone straight, not bone straight, but you know, like as less texture as possible. So yeah, I went ahead and relaxed it for a third time. The last time I relaxed my hair, I was pregnant, you guys. Now I got my son here with me. He's eight months old. Ain't that crazy? I was pregnant in both of those relaxer videos. And now he's here. Like this little dude was in my stomach the entire time. That's so funny. And as you can see, he's perfectly fine. I know some girls are like hesitant to relax their hair when they're pregnant. If you're not comfortable, then don't do it. But I wasn't comfortable and, or I was comfortable. And clearly, as you see, my baby boy is perfectly fine. Can you smile? <laughs> I love you. I just want to come on here and give y'all a quick little intro. And I did do like a keratin protein treatment at the end as well. I'm gonna show y'all all of that. So, yes. Okay, girl, the inches are inching. I wanna do like a length check to see how long my hair was last time because I feel like my hair has grown a lot and I did clip the ends as well just so it could be like a tiny bit more even than it was. Period. We are freshly relaxed, girl. Every three months, I plan to relax my hair. So yeah, girl, I'm trying to get some inches. And I feel like my hair honestly grows better when it's relaxed because my hair is super kinky and curly. So whenever I like comb it, I feel like it breaks easier. But when my hair is relaxed, it's not all that tension. And you know, I don't know if that makes sense, but it made sense in my head. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get into it. Oop, are you okay? We're gonna go ahead and get into it. I'm gonna go ahead and do like a voiceover version. Where are you trying to go? <laughs> like, not you trying to climb me. Say hi, Dada. <laughs> so yes, I'm gonna go ahead and let y'all get into the video. And yes, girl. Third time's the charm. I know I can talk a lot, so let's go ahead and hop into it, girl. So like I said, it's been a year since I relaxed my hair. The last time I relaxed my hair was last November. It's now November 10th, so period. It's time to relax the hair. I have so much new growth, you guys. As you can see, I have super, super, super thick hair. My natural texture is definitely 4C. It's so hard. It's been so hard to work with because like the roots are so kinky and the rest isn't. So yeah, it was time. This was the night before. I went ahead and parted my hair into eight sections, detangled it, and put it in braids so it'll be nice and detangled. You're not supposed to irritate your scalp before a relaxer, so that's why I'm doing this the night before. So I will be using two packets of the olive oil full application no light hair relaxer, two packs, because like I said, my hair is super thick and I do plan on treating this like a virgin relaxer and applying it over all of my hair. So I definitely need two because last time I only used one and it was not enough and my hair did not take well at all. So what I'm doing right now is I'm just putting coconut oil on the ends of my hair just so I can protect them from the relaxer because I mean even though I did apply it to my entire head I just wanted to coat the very ends with the coconut oil. Now I'm going to go ahead and go around my hairline with the petroleum jelly with some Vaseline because I'm not trying to burn myself especially around my ears. When I was doing my relaxer I got it on my ears multiple times. Times. so I'm so glad that I put tons on my ear and my neck as well because when like I put my hair down the relaxer gets on my neck my skin has become really sensitive back there so I just wanted to make sure it was protected girl okay then I just put a bit of hair grease on my scalp just on like where I parted it though I didn't go through my entire head and grease my scalp I just went through where I made the parts because I feel like that's where the relaxer is gonna get at most when I'm relaxing my hair because it's already sectioned. Um, and my hair was super dirty to be honest with you. I just took out braids that I had in for maybe a month or two. So I felt like the dirt would have protected my scalp too. So that's why I didn't do my full head 
but yes now it's time to mix the relaxer girl like I said I am using two and I'm so glad I did I ran through that first pack so fast if you have thick hair and you're doing like a virgin relaxer make sure you get two packs of relaxer okay because if you watch my previous videos I only did one and girl it was pointless okay my hair was still kinky and curly but yes I'm gonna just shut up and let y'all watch me <laughs> mix this relaxer Now that the relaxer is mixed, I went ahead and unbraided all of my hair just because I didn't want to take the time while I'm applying the relaxer to do that because, girl, it's like a race against time when applying a, rel a relaxer. So I went ahead and unbraided everything and I clipped the first two sections together and then I left the back two out and then I went ahead and applied the relaxer that way. And you will see I did start off using like that the application brush but it's so much faster with my hands and trying to part my hair with the tiny rat tail on the back of the brush it just wasn't doing it so I set me a timer for 25 minutes and I went ahead and got straight to it y'all see in the beginning I was being so neat with the applicator brush but it was just trying to part my hair like my hair is so thick girl it, it, I just had to use my hands after a while so I'm gonna just let y'all watch me apply this relaxer and then I did rinse my hair when I only had five minutes left um, on the 25 minute timer and then I took the last five minutes to just strictly rinse my hair out and then I did shampoo and condition with the shampoo and conditioner that came in the box so yes girl I'm gonna stop talking now <laughs> If I can say one thing, it's smoothing your hair after you apply the relaxer. I feel like it really makes the difference. So I made sure to do that and just allowing the relaxer to sit on your hair for long enough. I wish I would have allowed it to sit for that extra five minutes instead of rinsing it out five minutes early, but that's okay. <laughs> I was still satisfied with the results. But make sure you smooth your relaxer down, okay? It's gonna make all the difference in the world.
So these were the results. I honestly thought it was gonna come out a lot straighter because when I was rinsing it, I, I just felt like it was a lot straighter. And then I looked in the mirror and I'm like, okay, but it's okay, I can work with this. There is still some texture, but it's a lot more manageable than it was before. So now all I'm doing is applying the conditioner that was in the box in that yellow packet. And then I put a plastic bag over my head because I didn't have a shower cap. And I sat under a hooded dryer for 15 minutes and then I rinsed it out. After rinsing the conditioner out, I wanted to take it a step further and give myself a keratin protein treatment. I've used this stuff in the past and it makes my hair so soft. I love it. It says to only leave it on your hair for two to three minutes, but I put it on my hair, I detangle my hair, and then I put a plastic cap or a plastic bag over my head and I allow it to sit with no heat for 15 minutes. started doing is detangling my hair in the shower I feel like it's way easier that way so I got this brush from Target and that's what I'll be doing I'm just detangling my hair and yeah girl I'll talk to you in a second I do have on a shirt okay let's go ahead and take my hair out it's been in this shirt for like about 20 minutes to like a half hour Girl, can we say three times the three times the charm? Three times the charm. Third time relaxing my hair. The front right here, I should have left the relaxer on longer because as you can see, it's a little more texture. But I don't care about the front, to be honest with you. <laughs> oh, girl. And I know I applied the relaxer like a virgin relaxer when I, girl, my hair is already relaxed. But if you watch the previous relaxer videos the second time i relaxed my hair like the corrective relaxer the ends still didn't get straight i went a whole year without relaxing my hair so there was a lot of new growth which didn't get completely straight there is still some texture as you can see but it's okay here we are my hair is super soft so I'm about to go ahead and blow dry my hair. I am really satisfied with the results though. I could have left it on the front a little longer, but it's still like flat if I were to pull it back. So that's all I care about. So I'm about to go ahead and blow dry my hair. Let me show y'all what I use to blow dry my hair first. So I'm gonna be using this Tymo Nourishing and Smoothing Hair Oil. I'm not sure what's in this, I will go to, go to their website and figure it out and put it on the screen because I'm not sure what is in this, but I've used it and I love the way this stuff like just leaves my hair shiny and even more soft. And then I'll also be using this New Lengths. Can y'all see? The Pantene Gold Series New Length Anti-Breakage Serum. I'm gonna put some of that in and then I'm gonna be using this heat protective spray. This is Bondi Boost. And it's got aloe vera in it, a vitamin B5, rosemary. It just got a whole bunch of stuff in here. And I've used this before too. I love this heat protectant. So yeah, let's go ahead and blow dry. Oh, I'm so excited, y'all. My hair is so freaking soft. Oh! I'm about to go ahead and part my hair into four sections. I am 
going to use some moisturizer before I put the serums in first too. So I'm going to use this Sweet Honey Hair Milk. And then I'm going to apply in the serums and the heat protectant. And then I'm going to go ahead and blow dry. And change of plans, y'all. I'm not going to use this serum because I'm using this serum. I just don't want my hair to be too heavy. So <laughs> excuse all the change ups. But yeah, so I'm just going to use the moisturizer, the Pantene Gold Series anti breakage Serum, and then this heat protectant. I'm going to really focus on the ends. To straighten my hair, I do do the chase method. So I use this perfect little red tail comb and this gets my hair the straightest. Like if you want the straight silk press look, girl, do the chase method, okay?
attention to you and your friends. You know how I spend in me. S-T-O-N, I get too crazy. Got a little bad email. We stay good friends. We get too crazy. All I know is that when this cup ends, the next one begins. Papa, you know me. And you know me back then. And you know how it goes when I see you again. You know I'm making my way to your ends. And you know I need to be there. You a little post so baby. You a little 48 baby. Got a little candy in her pocket. She gon' take off like a. You already know. Ready to up a cup, I'm on the no side. Think she what I know, you probably go aside. Know I gotta come and check the whole man, baby. Go tight. I just switch the city with the G block stainers. And we got a doctor by some free four strangers. You know what it means when I twist these fingers. Me and you been on a first name basis. Why you think I hate it when you talk that Drake shit? Same reason that you never left me hanging. Same reason that I tried to make you famous. Same reason that I tried to show you just who I was. Outside of the club. Outside the things that a man like me does Outside of the things that would cause you to judge Outside of the club So you just who I was Outside of the club So these were the final results and you guys, I am in love with my hair, okay? Not me having inches. I do plan on doing like relaxer update videos and relaxer touch ups. So thank you for watching and I will see y'all in the next video. Bye y'all.